I was like, if I have the hijab, like, I can't suck. Like, I have to be good. Like, I, I can't embarrass, like, the whole entire religion just because I wear my hijab. I was just basically, like, a regular girl who, like, played basketball. There wasn't much girls my age who played basketball, so, like, I would always go to other communities and, like, people who, um, like, played and wanted to play in college. So I think after a year, I realized that um, that's when I started trying to get other girls from my community who to play. They weren't, like, really accepting it at first, but, like, gradually, like, over the years, like, they, they welcomed the sport. I mean, that first video was, um... It was crazy because it was my birthday that day. My phone died because I was just on Twitter the whole time, just refreshing it. But I was telling them like, this guy's is gonna go crazy. Like it's going viral, guys. And like, they didn't believe me. And so like, I woke up the next morning and they were all calling me like, oh my God, like the video is crazy, right? Like it blew up like overnight. Yeah, my favorite thing about basketball is just how it brings everyone together. Like how much opportunities there is within the sport, not just playing it, but outside of it as well. And how it just brings people together like through the basketball camps they get to know each other um, they build that community of like hoopers in their city my dad was very supportive at first and then my mom was just a bit hesitant because um, there's just a lot of like women her age group like a lot of moms that used to tell her like why is your daughter playing basketball why is she doing sports like they've never seen it before it's like uh, common that they thought of that but um, their daughters never played like their daughters didn't play so I was the only girl that used to be at the basketball court. Like especially like seeing a Somali girl, like Somalis, they get very um, prideful for that. So like they, they love seeing that stuff and they encourage more of it too. I mean, like through social media, it was always like, like, oh, you're, you're a Muslim girl. Like, why are you playing sports? Like that was the only thing that like a lot of people said, like it's 2023 20, now. So like, it's just like getting out of that old mindset that some people have and like making sure the younger generation know that it's okay for them to do whatever they want to do, if it's like something positive for them.